I think it's like being a parent, isn't it? Because it's just like, it's 24 hours a day. It's just like you don't go home and then nighttime you're gonna switch off and you don't think about it. It's just like, I think I've just developed so much being my own boss. I think I've got a sense of confidence that I've never ever had. Need but them. you need them at the but same I'm, time. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So when you put them on, you're like, whoa, it's like wearing magnifying glasses, <laughs> but you can still see. But it, it sounds like you need them more, though. I function as an optician in terms of I supply glasses and lenses, but people go to get their eyes tested. And I have vintage frames, and then I have new frames, but I also design frames and do bespoke like frame making for people. I'm slightly obsessed by glasses, like optics. It's quite scientific and it's just like a lot of the shops I worked in were so scientific and that's not my nature. People don't buy glasses that often, like every couple of years, if that. So it's a purchase, such an infrequent purchase, they're not very good at it. And then you stand in a shop that it's got bright lights and it's all like, it looks like a science lab. I think it's pretty intimidating. So I, the idea of having somewhere that's got, you know, silly music and a nice atmosphere and I think people appreciate it. I think that, you know, it makes them feel more relaxed but, and it certainly makes me feel more relaxed. My new glasses! Obviously because they're dark, so you're they're seeing nice. the darker side of them. They're, but they're great and they work really well even in that, you know, that kind of intermediate period where it's yeah, not yeah. that, do you know what I mean, which is I, a really important part with yeah. the uh, transitions, I think. My partner is a furniture maker and he's changed his, uh, moved his skill set to hand making spectacles. Um, and because I've always like designed them for people, uh, we're kind of collaborating and he is making the frames in, in my old art studio around the corner and it's nearby, so we basically go from there to here. I got put about half six in the morning. I'll start work at eight, uh, and then I'll work through to five, and about twice a week at the moment, I'll come straight from work here, and I'll work here till about 10 o'clock. We haven't had a lot of money to invest straight away, so I've, I've been working and then using my wages to pay for machinery. You know, sometimes I think about being at work, like how I used to be, and that I only need to think about that for like five minutes, and I'm very happy to be. I like being independent, I like being my own boss. I like, when you achieve something, you totally achieve it for yourself, and that's great.